quite a day. I'd like to inquire about your spoons. Magic is happening here at the studio. <laughs> And uh, I am so excited to show you what we have coming. When I initially saw David's tweet that he was looking for a green-skinned actor to voice Salad Fingers, I felt a plethora of different emotions. I was incredibly offended. A white man was voicing one of my people forever? It was almost like a betrayal. I didn't even realize how offended I was until I was told that it was super offensive. And then when I realized that I could get something out of it, so much more offended. We wanted to give proper representation to green people. I got pressured into signing that deal, and fair enough, it was for a lot of money. Switching to live action, a lot of things are gonna change. You know, there's a few things we had to change, but I feel like we're making the character more real as a green man. We are sticking to the original vision of the cartoon. David is still consulted a lot. These idiots aren't listening to a word I've said. They're ruining my own cartoon. David, I'm telling you, we are gonna edit out the hair. The Auntie Bainbridge character has a lot of depth and it wasn't an easy casting process. But when Princess came into the studio, everyone was completely, completely speechless. Yeah, exploring the character of Jeremy Fisher has been very fun. But something that's kind of weird is that Thomas keeps coming up to me off set and asking to stick his fingers in my hole. Right now we're dealing with a few legal hurdles with Thomas. Language is a weird thing. He just keeps saying he wants to stick his fingers in my hole. I am an actor and I like to work with puppets and holes and that's what I was trying to communicate. But it's not a problem. He's gonna be on billboards. He's gonna be on posters. I was trying to pitch a few things here and there. David and I are going back and forth. Sometimes we need to make decisions that he doesn't understand. Because this is about a green person's life and he's not your circus clown to shave his head. To Everything I say, they're saying that I'm being unreasonable. People don't like bald protagonists. We wanted to give Salad Fingers a little more panache this time around. We are staying true to his vision. So without further ado, here is the new trailer for the Salad Fingers movie. Don't care if you're bothered. 